Okay, here are two of my favorite street foods in Korea. Tteokbokki and sundae. So what comes with tteokbokki is a kind of spicy sauce which is made with, you know, corn syrup, ketchup, uh, a few ingredients like that as well as water. So it's pretty spicy though there are different varieties, some which are sweeter and some which are spicier. And it's called tteokbokki because you've got in there tteok, which is rice cake, and bokki, which means kind of like to pan fry something. So you have pan fried rice cake, but it's a lot more than the name means. And another thing that comes with tteokbokki is omuk, which is pretty much a uh, fish cake. The main ingredient in it is fish, which kind, I wouldn't know. And sometimes if you get lucky, you'll get an egg in here, but I don't think I'm lucky today. So anyway, let's give the tteokbokki a try first. Hmm. This kind isn't really that spicy. Hmm. But not only do you get, oh, it's actually kind of spicy. But not only do you get duck with tteokbokki, some things that can come with tteokbokki are deep fried squid, shrimp, or kimari, which is pretty much just seaweed wrapped around a bunch of potato noodles. I think I'm gonna have the squid first. So you can eat these just by themselves, but I usually recommend, and most people will recommend, dipping them in the sauce for the tteokbokki and eating them. Hmm. If you're a fan of fried seafood, this is especially great. So next I'm gonna go on to sundae. Sundae is my favorite food in Korea. Now the way to make sundae doesn't sound very appetizing. Basically you take animal intestine and on the inside you fill it with noodles as well as well, blood. But it actually tastes really good. I've heard some people say that it's similar to like a blood sausage. Maybe it's an acquired taste, but I love this food. You can eat it by itself. You can also eat it by dipping it in some salt. My favorite way is you can eat it by dipping it in with tteokbokki sauce. Hmm. It's just the combination of the flavor of it, the texture of the noodles, and the light hint of salt that makes this perfect. So anyway, these are a couple of my favorite street foods in Korea. And if you ever get a chance to go to Korea, I would also recommend checking these out as well. Tteokbokki and sundae.